going on guys? KOD Foot here bringing you another episode of KOD Foot Talks. This one's a little different because I'm fucking drunk. So this one's drunk KOD Foot whatever. Suck my balls. Um, so yeah. So this episode is going to be about alcohol because I haven't covered that topic yet. And I figured why not get drunk talk about alcohol instead of be sober and talk about alcohol. So let's get started into it. Before we do though, we got the Q&A video. Oh, fuck. We got the Q&A video coming up. And so leave a comment. Any comment, any question, I don't give a fuck what it is. We'll answer it in the next Q&A video that's coming up. Me and Faz got that coming out soon. So check it out. But anyway. Let, oh, yeah. Woo! Let's get started into it. Today's topic is alcohol. So... Lou, Lou, whoop, whoop. Lou, Lou, whoop, whoop. <laughs> That's my roommate. He's fucking trying to jump in this shit. Uh, before we get started, in the, um, I do not condone underage drinking. Before we get started into it, I'm going to be talking about underage drinking. Don't fucking do it. You're fucking stupid. I was stupid. Don't be stupid like I was stupid. But anyway, so let's talk about alcohol. My first fucking shot, I was five years old. I did a shot of fucking Jack Daniels whiskey. At five years old, one of my mom's friends thought that it would be funny while she was in the bathroom to go ahead and give me a shot. I did it. I didn't know any better to say no. So we went ahead and went with it. It was horrible. I puked everywhere. It was bad. But then i got older and i probably started drinking like really drinking at like 13 i guess i started drinking smeared off vodka uh, a lot of cheap vodkas a lot of cheap whiskeys but i never really did like cheap cheap whiskey because whiskey always makes me angry i don't know what's up with that like for uh, 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 for some reason, anyway, whenever I drink whiskey, I get violent, and I get angry, and I get pissed off. Oh, fuck. Sorry, I ate pizza before I drank tonight, and it's got me all indigestion-y. Alright, I'm good. So anyway, yeah, when I was like 12, 13 years old, me and my boys, we started ordering fucking liquor. We had a delivery service. It was a uh, pennies. It was a sub shop that you could order subs and you could order beer or liquor and cigarettes from. But you had to have somebody that was above age to sign for it. So we'd always go to the local neighborhood crackhead. And we'd be like, yo, look, we're trying to get some alcohol. If you sign it, we'll throw you like 10 bucks. So go ahead and sign it. So, we'd order it from Penny's, and then man would show up. We'd have our above-age friend sign whatever we need into, and then we'd have alcohol. We'd go to the, we'd go to the uh, elementary school, and we'd drink, and we'd hang out. Or wintertime, oh man, wintertime, we'd hang out up at the creek. Not the crick, the creek. We'd hang up <laughs> I'm fucked up. I drank like a fifth of fucking fireball. I'm fucking smashed. But I'm not condoning drinking. Smoke weed. Don't drink. It's better for you. But anyway, I've been drinking tonight. And it's a fucking good time. I thought it'd be fun to do a KOD foot talks while drunk. Especially when the topic of alcohol. I figured that the topic of alcohol. Don't mind the slur. I figured, that the, <laughs> I figured that the topic of alcohol would be better handled if I was drunk. And that was probably a bad move, but whatever. You probably shouldn't listen to anything that I say. Like, my last topic where I was talking about bullies, you probably shouldn't beat that bully in the head. I probably should have put a fucking viewer discretion advised ahead of that. But, yeah, don't beat your bully in the head with a baseball bat. Don't get drunk like I get drunk because you'll probably die. Don't do it. I don't want nobody to die because they thought they could hang like, you know, KOD foot hangs. Because KOD foot hangs like a big dang line swing. <laughs> Fuck. 
<sighs> yeah. So, anyway, this is going to be a fun fucking episode. It's like halfway over and shit. But anyway, so we, <laughs> we used to order alcohol from the delivery service. And we'd be like, let me get a fifth of vodka. Let me get a case of beer. And let me get a pack of smokes. And dude would show up with it. And we'd have some random crackhead from the neighborhood sign for it. And then we'd go hang out at the elementary school, and we'd drink the vodka, or we'd drink the beer, or whatever. And it was always a good time. And then, when I turned 21, <clears throat> ugh, drinking had kind of gotten boring for me, you know, because I'd been drinking... I don't know. I won't say that I've been drinking for the whole time, but I started drinking, like, heavy at, like, 12, 13 years old. Again, I do not condone that. Do not take this as I'm trying to convince fucking teenagers to drink. It is a bad idea. But, from personal experience, that's when I started doing it. I start. Oh, fucking indigestion and alcohol and shit. Got me burping all over the place. Fucking pizza and beer. Fucking liquor. Whatever. So yeah, I, I personally started drinking at like 12, 13 years old, heavily, and it was whatever, you know, i drink on the weekends, i drink during the week, and it was bad, I turned into a raging alcoholic where I couldn't function if I didn't have alcohol, and that's not good, like, you know, it, it's one thing to have fun and drink with your boys on the weekend or something like that. But then it's a completely different thing to, like, you know, you wake up and you're like, oh my god, I need alcohol right now. That's a completely different thing. And, like, alcoholics, they're only alcoholics because they go to meetings. You know, <laughs> and that, that was always the, the rule of thumb. If you weren't that bad off that you had to go to meetings, that you weren't an alcoholic. And I was fine with being a outskirt alcoholic. Somebody that would get drunk on the regular but wouldn't have to actually go to meetings because I wasn't that bad off. And that was fun and everything. And then I turned 21 and it kind of lost its appeal for me. And I wish that I had waited until I was older before I started drinking like I did. Because I think I would have had more fun with it. But after I turned 21, you know, I was doing a lot of Jaeger bombs, I was drinking a lot, and then all of a sudden it was like, I don't even like drinking like that no more. And I haven't been as drunk as I am right now in a long fucking time. I'll drink occasionally from time to time, have a couple beers with a few friends from time to time. But most of the time, I stay relatively sober, and I have no problem with that. There's no issue with staying sober. You can have just as much fun sober as you can drunk. But then there's other nights where I'm like, fuck it, I'm 21 years old, I'm legal to drink, I can do whatever the fuck I want, and I'm gonna smash a fifth of Fireball because fuck you, YOLO swag, right? So... <laughs> 420 blaze it faggot right like <laughs> whatever i got my roommate back here egging me on fucking dickhead but anyway this video is getting ready to wrap up so leave a comment below let me know have you been drunk are you an alcoholic i hope you're not an alcoholic please don't be an alcoholic do you like to drink with your boys do you like to drink with your non-boys do you drink by yourself whatever Shut up, Lou. Anyway, so leave a comment below. Leave a like if you like my drunk ramblings. I may make this a series where drunk fucking KOD Foot rambles. And until next time, I'm KOD Foot. Later.